Hyundai recently made a huge announcement, one that's destined to drastically alter not just the South Korean, but also the global EV market as a whole. But how exactly is Hyundai taking the EV market by storm? And why should you be excited for the future of electric power transportation? Join us as we uncover how Hyundai aims to flip the tables on competitors like Tesla and dominate the EV market with their upcoming Giga factory. We all know Hyundai. In fact, if you travel anywhere by car or public transport, chances are pretty big that you see at least a handful of cars manufactured by Hyundai every time. I mean, these cars are everywhere nowadays due to its build quality, reliability, safety, and affordability. Now, let me bring you up to speed with this company because it plays a big role in this story. Founded in 1967, the South Korean car company quickly grew from its humble beginnings to one of the world's largest and most recognized car manufacturers, having sold almost 3 million cars just in 2021. Ever since its conception, the company spared no effort in branching out, seeking investors, landing contracts, signing deals, and eventually owning about 34% of the Kia Corporation as well as its very own luxury vehicle division, Genesis Motor, and electric vehicle sub-brand, Ionic. Clearly not lacking in ambition by this point, the industry juggernaut now sets its eyes on dominating the electric car market, hoping to wrench it from the hands of Tesla, who until now is still by far the most dominant electric car manufacturer, holding almost 70% of the market share in the United States alone. To get an idea of how ambitious Hyundai's plans are, and how difficult taking on an industry giant like Tesla will be, it's important to look at the history of Tesla and how they managed to become the apex predator of electric cars we all know today. When it comes to the EV market, it's no secret Tesla and Hyundai have been going at each other's necks for quite some time, always innovating and improving on their electric car designs, with Hyundai managing to earn a loyal following among the EV-loving community due to its reliable products, affordable prices, and great performance. Tesla, however, remains another beast entirely, constantly remaining ahead of the competition in a league of its own almost ever since capricious entrepreneur and primary shareholder Elon Musk assumed the title as its new CEO back in 2008, somehow managing to skyrocket Tesla's growth in ways previously thought to be impossible. Under Elon's leadership, the one small-time American independent automaker quickly cemented its place as a pioneer in the electric car market by unveiling in 2012 what would soon become its signature flagship luxury sedan, the Model S. The Model S quickly proved to be a major hit with auto buyers, ranking best in class for every category relating to electric sedans and receiving a near-perfect 99 out of 100 score from Consumer Reports, while also being crowned as the best car ever tested. The Tesla Model S now sits as Tesla's longest-running EV in production to date. That's not to say Tesla's success can be attributed solely to the Model S. On the contrary, Tesla recognized very early on that it was tapping into a marketplace with a lot of potential and room for growth, and capitalized on its short-term newfound success with the Model S by building large factories called Gigafactories to produce everything under the sun, pun not intended, from light panels and solar batteries to fully functioning electric vehicles. The first such factory opened in Nevada, 2016, with more factories being built in New York and China later on, and many more planned in the future. As of this year, Tesla has six gigafactories all over the world, and they're working on building more. Fast forward to 2022, and many still credit Tesla's Cinderella story of extraordinary success and substantial growth of the company's market capitalization, which now rests at an astonishing 910 billion US dollars, by the way, to its ingenious foresight in taking over the marketplace while it was still an infant, capitalizing on the lack of any real competition at the time to influence its growth in many ways that benefited the up-and-coming car company and allowed it to hog the spotlight for more than a decade. Now, with all that put into perspective, it's no wonder Tesla's South Korean counterpart falls short of replicating even a fraction of the success Tesla has amassed over the years. But the slumbering titan of the car industry, Hyundai, is finally awake and believes a change is long overdue. Recently, the company's CEO, Jae-hoon Chang, made a shocking announcement by unveiling what he called Hyundai's secret electrification roadmap promising to invest over $16 billion in EV-related projects, all in an attempt to take over the EV market. According to the South Korean automakers' plans, they believe electric vehicles will become highly profitable in the near future, stating, by enhancing competitiveness in our hardware and software capabilities with an expanded lineup, battery electric vehicles will become very profitable. 
And this was followed by yet another announcement where Hyundai pledged to become a globally carbon neutral entity by 2045. Hyundai and sister companies Kia and Genesis have recently even taken the U.S. market by storm with their never-before-seen surge in EV sales following their unveiling of a robust lineup of future electric projects. The company's plans for the future were highlighted by the introduction of 17 different electric car models by 2030 including 11 Hyundai brand models and six luxury Genesis vehicles. Genesis even announced plans to go all-electric by 2030, ditching new combustion models completely by 2025. At the same time, sibling brand Kia intends to include eight battery electric vehicles in its U.S. lineup by 2029. Among the new Hyundai BEVs, there will be three sedan models, including Hyundai Ioniq 6 in 2022, six SUVs, including Hyundai Ioniq 7 in 2024, one light commercial vehicle, and one new model yet to be revealed. All of this coincides with yet another announcement Hyundai made recently regarding their desire to produce almost 2 million battery electric vehicles annually come 2030, a huge leap from the previously set goal of 560,000 EVs by 2025, which is estimated to achieve a 7% share of the global electric market. It looks like Tesla may have just toppled off its solar-powered throne soon enough. Rest assured, Elon Musk is not happy at all with his company's position as a worldwide number one electric car manufacturer being under threat. And he'll no doubt be putting up a fierce fight by announcing his own projects in an attempt to hold on to his company's monopoly over the market. So far, Tesla has been awfully quiet. Not much was heard from the company regarding the future other than the announcement of the Model Y, Model X, Model S, and Tesla Cybertruck. Whatever its plans may be, Tesla's efforts fall awfully short as Hyundai is not only striking first, but striking hard as well. How hard, do you ask? Well, Hyundai is planning on breaking grounds for multiple new EV factories all over the world, including the United States, which has been widely regarded as Tesla's personal backyard since the dawn of time. Starting in the early 2023, construction of Hyundai's full EV and electric battery producing facilities is set to begin in Georgia, shifting gears and becoming fully capable of sustainable mass production by 2025. It's worth mentioning that this somewhat vicious assault on Hyundai's part isn't just the company being greedy and wanting a bigger piece of Tesla pie, as it also likely has to do with the declining sales of internal combustion engine vehicles due to the schedule banning of such automobiles in a handful of marketplaces the world over. So, Hyundai's aggressive efforts to better incorporate battery-powered vehicles into its product lineup may not be an optional detour but a necessary one to ensure the company continues to prosper. The battle between the two colossal entities will unquestionably be fierce and lead to a plethora of new, amazing inventions and innovations that will undoubtedly benefit all of humanity. So this exciting news sheds a favorable light on the future of green, environmentally friendly modes of transportation. Moreover, it may even fast-forward humanity on the road to ditching CO2-emitting cars completely, helping us put a stop to air pollution and hopefully reversing some of the damage caused to our planet's delicate climate over the past few decades. And that's not to mention, of course, the many improvements to design and function we are bound to witness as these two companies give it their all in an attempt to one-up each other and come out on top. Now, if you've come this far into the video, you may have noticed we believe Hyundai has the upper hand right now, and that's not just a lucky guess. In what appears to be Hyundai's attempt at a clean 1-2 knockout, Hyundai unleashed one of its most ambitious plans to date, the construction of a colossal, EV-only, $5.5 billion factory in its very own home, South Korea, the very first of its kind to open in the country in almost three decades. The South Korean Gigafactory is estimated to produce a whopping 300,000 electric cars annually. To put that into perspective, Tesla, with all its factories and facilities scattered all over the US, Germany, Canada, and even China, can only currently muster a measly 1 million cars per year, meaning Hyundai's Gigafactory alone will be worth about a third of Tesla's annual production. The question is, will Hyundai's plans for total domination of the electric car marketplace succeed? Or does Tesla yet have an ace up its own sleeve to put its competitors' foolish ambitions to rest once and for all? Only the future holds these answers. For now, all we can really do is speculate. One thing is for sure, however, the final outcome will almost certainly be in favor of you, the consumer. And I don't know about you, but I feel there's never been a more exciting time to be an EV enthusiast.